Hi, this is Jason with Yaldell Scientific, and today we're showing the download, setup, and use of the Excel to Outlook software add-in. To download the Excel to Outlook software add-in, simply click on the link supplied to you via email. Download the supplied zip file. Once the zip file has been downloaded, you will need to extract its contents and paste it to your Microsoft add-ins folder. Then our next step is to launch Microsoft Excel. With Excel launched, we can go into the options to enable the add-in. Once the add-in has been enabled, you will see a tab on the Excel ribbon entitled as EO Add-in, which stands for Excel to Outlook Add-in. As an example in using the add-in, let's open up a sample Excel file that contains some data. In this particular example, we have various records separated by rows that contain points of contact in a column I. To set up the software, we simply click on the EO Add-in tab and then click on the Setup icon within that particular group. This will display a custom interface for us to set up the Excel to Outlook add-in. We can prepare a canned subject line for any emails that are going to be automatically generated off of this Excel sheet. We will do that now by entering subject line text. We can also enter an email body template. Again, this is a canned email body template that we can prepare for any of the records that are going to be automatically generated as emails based off this Excel sheet. The last part of the setup is to set the column letter for context. This is our way of telling the software add-in which column within the Excel file contains the listing of contacts, email addresses, or names that we want to add to the Outlook email. In this particular situation, our Excel sheet has a column I with a list of contacts for each individual record or row we will escalate and generate emails based off of column I. Once we have set up everything within the system, we're now ready to use the software plugin. So in order to escalate, we simply click on EO Add-in, it will then automatically scan the Excel file for all of the unique contacts or escalation points found within column I. In this particular situation, it found four unique names that are to be escalated upon based off of the Excel to Outlook added. To generate our escalation emails, we simply select a name from the list. It is automatically filtered and selected for within the range. And then we can click the link that says, click here to generate single email. This will automatically 
launch Microsoft Outlook and generate our email for us as seen here. We can also batch process all of the contacts within our Excel file and generate emails based off of that particular information in one click by clicking on the click here to batch process all emails. If I click that now, Microsoft Outlook is automatically generated within the background for each one of the records with a unique name. In this particular situation, we see our first email is addressed to Jane Doe and all, and all of the records that are associated with Jane Doe are automatically added to the email. We then see that it goes through the list and generates emails for all of the other contacts that are existing within the Excel file. Here we have one for Richard Doe and the associated data. We also have one for Mary Doe and her associated data. And lastly, we have one for John Doe and all of his associated data. Please note that the software is also configured to automatically attach a copy of the data set as an attachment to the actual Outlook email. This is automatically performed if the number of records that are being included within the data set is 10 or more.